All right, here we go. Welcome, my friends, to our discussion here with our project management professional and earned value management professional, who is Daryl Mesa. Daryl has been in the project management community for a while. Daryl has been working very hard on a new uh, app, and this is the app. It's an earned value management chatbot. Is that right, Daryl? That's correct, Bill. So first of all, congratulations on this great accomplishment. Um, it's not every day that you get a project manager who doubles as an IT expert that can do this kind of thing. But then you also have a propensity for all things project controls, Daryl. So what informed your creation of this tool? What inspired you? What motivated you to create it? I, the admiration of ChatGPT given me the opportunity to create GPTs. So I created Adam, the EVM bot, in a GPT platform. And my thought process was, if I can create this through OpenAI, why can I publish this to the Apple App Store or Google App Store and have it used publicly for everybody to use? That's fantastic. In other words, you're trying to help people, Daryl. Because when I go into this tool, I realize that this is this is actually a free tool that people who use earn value, like people who might be on some sort of construction site or oil rig somewhere or those superintendents who need to use earn value in some way, they can get some help and advice from a tool and it's free. That's that's really admirable for this to be free. And there's a reasoning, there's many reasons behind it, um, mainly because we need to stay at the safe side of AI. Right now, it's powered by ChatGPT um, using retrieval augmented generation type of um, uh, perspective on how to get the, the, the knowledge back to you or back to the user. So everything that Every document that I'm using to train Adam is all is all open source document, meaning you can you can upload it, download it from the from, from the internet. That that's brilliant, Daryl. I'm going to take it for a test spin. What I like about this app is you can do voice to text, and I'm just going to ask it a question. Here's a question. What are the earned value management formulas for SPI and cost? So I've given it my command. You can see that's what I wrote there. And I'm going to hit enter and boom. It doesn't miss a beat. It just spits them out right there, which is which is really, really awesome. I should probably turn down the lighting so that people can see what this looks like because the lighting on my phone is a little bit on the high side. So let's turn that down a little bit and then I'll show everyone what this looks like. I can. And uh, yeah, that's it. Really, really good. Uh, good performance from the app. I mean, it didn't waste a second and it gives me all the SPI and it give, also gives me the um, four acronym um, CPI um, formula. So instead of EV divided by um, AC, it gives you BCWP over ACWP, which, mm -hmm. <laughs> which, which is a, a very advanced level. But let me, let me see if, if, if I can ask it another question. Can you give me those formulas using the two letter acronym instead of the four old style acronyms like EV instead of BCWP? All right, it's converting it to text and let's hit enter. And yeah. Boom, didn't, didn't miss a beat. Gave me CPI as EV over AC. 
you know, so there, there you have it. Nice. I mean, this is a really great tool. So Daryl, can you tell us what is, what is your idea for uh, people who might be doing away with earned value who say earned value is just no good. We're not going to use it anymore. After all, the government isn't using it anymore in IT. What do you have to say to the skeptics, the earned value skeptics? EPM is still useful in, in many projects. Um, I know the government just recently um, went away with having EVM implemented into software projects. However, EVM is a very powerful tool, very powerful method in project management that every project manager should at least explore in, in their project management career. I, I believe so too. So Daryl, if people want to get this awesome tool that you've created on the Apple Store. It's only on the Apple Store for now. In the future, it will get to uh, the Google Store. But what do they need to put in the search? They need to type in um, EVM bot all, all together. Um, it can either be lowercase or capital. And it will be the first um, app in the Apple App Store that will show up after you type out the EVM bot. That is awesome, Daryl. So for viewers at home, going down to the Apple App Store, put in EVM bot, and it should be the first thing that comes up, right? Yes. Lovely. Thank you very much, Daryl. All the very best as you continue to change the world with your apps and your knowledge in project management. Thank you, Phil.